Hi, I'm Hadassah from Icon Canva. Welcome to my channel and to the Canva Snacks, a series of bite-sized tutorials in less than five minutes to teach you how to use Canva at its best. Please subscribe so you'll get notified every time a Canva Snack is uploaded to the channel and you're most welcome to also join my Facebook community called Icon Canva. Although in Hebrew, you can easily translate and enjoy free tips, tricks, and lots of inspiration. So, are you ready? Let's go! Let's say that I'm not sure that this is the right position for my title English lesson. Maybe I'd like to have it at the top left corner or maybe at the middle up here. Not really sure. So I can move it around each time, one object at a time. I don't like that. Let's learn how to group them together so we can move them as one unit. So let me just undo this and we have two options to group things together. The first easy option would be to click somewhere outside here and just drag my cursor so as if I'm hugging my objects. But what will happen is that it will catch on the way some things that I did not have any intention on grouping, like these little shapes. Once I do that, if I go up here to the white bar and click on group, it will all be grouped together and I can move this around and I can resize this. but I have these objects here that I don't want them. So let's ungroup this and I'll show you a better way to do that. I will just click on the first object I want to group, which would be my text box, and then I will press my shift key and keep it pressed. Don't leave it. And then click on object number two, which would be my yellow banner. Once I click on that, you can see that I have two frames. I have a dashed frame and this solid frame. Once I go up here and group this, this is all grouped together. I can resize this and I can check what works best for me. That's how you group things. Now, if you want to ungroup something, once you click on it and go to ungroup, it's ungrouped and you can move it around. Now, if you open a template and you're trying to move something that you did not group in the first place, once you click on it and you notice that you have this dashed frame, that's your sign that something is grouped. That's it. I hope you enjoyed the snack. Now, if you don't own a Pro account and you'd like to give it a try, I will be very happy to give you 45 days to try out Canva Pro for free. No strings attached. You'll find the link in the comments below. I'll see you all next time. Bye.